Go have fun today. We really talked about all along and this is fun. All right, have a great time today. I'm proud of you guys and I'm proud to be with you guys today. All right. We begin with the Division I Girls Golf Finals on the Forest Acres West Golf Course at Michigan State University. State runners up a year ago, Gross Point South, third trip to the finals in four years. We head to the par 5-8. Here is Blue Devil senior Kerry Farley feathering this short putt to save par. Then it's Kerry's sophomore teammate Ella Pendy, medalist at the regionals, nice putt on six. Later on the par 3-7, Pendy with another par plunge, GP South finished tied for third. Rochester Stony Creek, second straight year the team is in the championship. We go to the second hole, par five, a surefire miss golf candidate next year, junior Devin Compton for birdie. Later, teammate and sophomore standout Gabby Urich on three, par. Next hole, Gabby gets the seven footer to go for par. She had a two day total of 155, good for second individually. Stony Creek jumps up a spot from last year's fourth place finish. They wind up tied for third. Ranked in the top 10 most of the season, the Celine Hornets. On the third hole, it's the sophomore Carla Gross straight in for par. Then, doing it again, Celine takes second place, the Hornets' best finish since they last won states back in 1991. Rochester, the defending Division I champs looking for a sweet repeat. Led by Miss Golf candidate and MSU recruit Christine Meyer on one from the light rough, very comfortable on her future college course, just a beautiful approach within 15 feet. She'd par the hole. Later on the par 312, Christine again dialing in from long distance. The senior simply sizzling. This is a 60 foot birdie, nothing but the bottom of the cup. Then on the par 513, Meyer with another birdie opportunity. One over par 73 on Friday, 74 on Saturday. Like her sister did a year ago, Christine was your medalist, winning it by eight shots. We head on over to the par 5 second. This is Christine's Falcon teammate and All-Stater junior Rosalie Shu. This is shot three of the hole from well over 100 yards out, landing within striking distance. She'd par the hole. On the par 3 12th, again it's the junior Shu. This chip and she's knocking on the door. Back-to-back -back days with rounds of 82, shoe individually, a sixth place finish. And Rochester does it again. Second straight state title and third since 2002. They do it, winning by an impressive 24 shots. We always knew that we were gonna be up there and stuff, and we worked really hard all through the season, but winning it back-to-back, -back, especially in those conditions, is awesome. Like, we really proved that we're one of the best teams. It feels amazing. It's like all our hard work has finally paid off and um, it's great to win two years in a row knowing that we had the consistency both years. R-O-R-O-C-C-A-C-A-C-A-C-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E-S-E